Hey everyone, it's Jim. And Kayla. And, and this, this is Meteotech Weather. Weather. So at this point, I would yep, 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 yep. I said so. Don't many. you say another so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna have like 20 minutes of blue. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. You know, here in the Northern Hemisphere or the Southern Hemisphere, just call me two hemisphere. Ah! I love candles. Tool used to. Oh, am I filming still? Okay, yeah. <laughs> Test one, two. Test one, two. So. Four. Okay. okay. And happy Fujiwara Ring! Whoa! <laughs> Talk about the five best and worst parts of being a meteorology major. Today, I am filming advice for becoming a meteorology major. Today, we are going to be talking about some more college tips. Specifically, we'll be going over how to pick the best college for you. We are finally sitting down today to discuss what can I use an ATMS degree for? And today, we're gonna to show you the Fujiwara effect. Ready, go. <laughs> I'm getting dizzy. Monday. A little experiment. We're going to put these cookies in the car and see if we can cook these cookies since it's like a million and five degrees outside. So today we're going to be talking about what's the difference between hurricanes and tornadoes. Tornadoes are faster than hurricanes. Why? Because sometimes Depending on the kind of tornado and the kind of hurricane, they could be spinning. Hurricanes can be spinning, tornadoes can be spinning. A lot of stuff can be spinning. And here is our first storm of the day. Looks like it's about to start raining on us. There's Dad. We're going to take a look at Hurricane Dorian and where it's going to be headed. It looks like the hurricane has continued to move northwest and is going to become a major hurricane. Hurricane Dorian is continuing to take a track toward the Florida Peninsula at this point. The storm is now a strong category 5 with winds at 185 miles an hour gusting to 225. It looks like the Carolinas are next in the crosshairs for Hurricane Dorian. The models actually take the eye of Dorian a little bit closer to the Carolina coastline compared to the Florida coastline. The Carolinas, especially North Carolina, definitely pay attention to this storm. I am here in Surf City looking at Hurricane Dorian. The maximum sustained winds right now are about 115, so we can expect the winds and rain to start picking up throughout the day. Today is Friday, September 6th, and Hurricane Dorian made landfall at Cape Hatteras, North Carolina this morning around 8.35. Thank you guys for following us and keeping up with us on this Dorian journey. And we definitely look forward to doing more videos like this in the future. So thanks again guys, and we'll see you soon. So there's a little taste of what our channel has to offer. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook. We're so excited for all the videos and content that we have planned for 2020, so... So check back every Monday for new videos. Until next time, I'm Kayla. And I'm Jim. Thanks for watching. And happy outro. Bye. Bye.